What's up, guys? My name is 3000, it's DMC665. Here today, guys, we are back playing some more Minecraft. And yeah, guys, to date, we are on the Brain Bus server. I'm just out exploring. And yeah, guys, um, so I'm just kind of walking around uh, the server exploring. It looks like it's getting late, so let's head back. I haven't found much, just found this birch forest, which is pretty cool. Uh, I found an endless supply of sheep everywhere. Um,. They're just everywhere. So, like, and my friend has a huge sheep farm in his basement. So I've just been killing him as I go along to get food. Um, so we're going to head back, and I'm going to show you guys spawn when we last left it. Uh, so I'm going to show you spawn now, and compared to when we last left it. Uh, so it's changed a lot, guys. Um, and when I say a lot, I mean a lot. The spawn is very very different I am very very lost and um, the for there is a forest fire going on I thought I left all those in my tornado survival series but I guess they've worked their way into my minecraft series as well <laughs> anyways uh, let's keep going so we got a zombie villager. Nothing big. Alright, so we have an extreme hills here. That's nice. We can attempt to get some emeralds. Maybe track down a village and get some emeralds from the village. I don't want to die out here. So. Um. Yeah, I'm going to cut, and then when I get back to spawn, I'll be back. Alright, guys, we're back at spawn here, and it's kind of late, but I'm going to try and show you guys everything before it gets too awful dark. So let's jump through here really fast, and I'll show you guys uh, the old area. So as you can see, uh, Temp made this area. Uh, it's pretty neat. I'll let him show that off in his video. Uh, I won't go too in depth with it. I'll just kind of glance at some stuff. He also made that farm and he made this area over here uh, which I'm about to show you really quickly. Um, if you want, no, I'll save that. So I made all this in the last episode as you guys know. I, didn't, I haven't done anything to this at all. Uh, besides where I moved out of this hole inside of the wall. Temp still lives down there. But, you know. So, as you guys can see, um, we kind of, me and Temp kind of came up with the idea to separate the map into regions. So, this region here is, uh, something. I, I, I forget, actually. I'm going to go read the sign really quickly. I'm pretty sure it's something. Riverside. Over here is all Riverside. Not all of it's by a river, but this this region over here is called Riverside. Uh, this region over here that I have claimed is called uh, I, I call it Ivy Wood. I made this neat little bridge you can cross. Uh, of course, you cross all bridges. And I still haven't gotten rid of that tree completely. I'll do it later, and I'll go up and show you guys my project, and then I'll explain a bit more uh, about my project. So, my project does involve putting stairs on this mountain so we can get up here a whole lot easier. Um, but so I'm making a bunch of a bunch of collective towers uh, for King Industries. This is one of them. They're all gonna have skylines collect connecting them. Every biome that I find. He's going to have a themed uh, uh, tower. It's going to have a themed tower with a skyline uh, in it. Uh, claimed for King Industries. Baby zombie villager. And it is a priest. Priest, yeah. Um, so, I'm going to put one over in the forest over there. The plains. I've already got one here in the acacia biome. I'm going to put one in the desert. And I'm going to connect them all with a skyline. And it's going to be absolutely epic. And... So make sure you guys stick around for that because I'm going to do recordings on every one that I build. So 
so far I've made quite a bit of progress with ores ore and ore wise um, so I made a couple of deals and I got some pretty good stuff uh, so right now I have enough redstone and um, so I've got enough redstone, a decent amount of quartz, not a whole lot. Uh, I got some diamonds, some iron, some lapis, uh, quite a bit of lapis actually, and some other just kind of random stuff because I did find a uh, a dungeon, but I have I have the coordinates marked down, but I don't have a solid route to it just yet. Uh, so you guys can see here all the stuff I've gone through there. Um, it's it definitely took me a while. I've been on here for a while, uh, searching. Those bunk beds were designed by Tim. Uh, if we head up here, you'll see uh, that I haven't finished yet. I'm making a spiral staircase up to the top of the tower. I'm going to have a couple of rooms off to the sides. And then I'm at the very top going to have a skyline, which will dip down and go over to the forest over in that direction, I think. Right? No, no, no. The forest is... Is it this? Yeah, yeah, it's the, yeah, it's this direction. Yeah, yeah. Cool, I'll try it. Um, but other than that, that's really it. Uh, some more iron I mined. Um, so I want to start my first uh project today uh, on camera. I want to do this. So, um, I wanted to do a project where I set up. A uh, little bit of a redstone machine I've been thinking about making for a while now. So it's going to require slime. So we're going to have to do some exploring this episode so we can get slime. I'll cut out most of the boring parts uh, or the dull moments. But um, So I'm going to try and find some slime uh, in a biome somewhere. Or a slime chunk maybe. I'll, I'll look around for it. And um, once I do that... I'll just let you guys get a better view here. I'm going to jump up here real quick. So once I get all of that done, um, we'll come back and we're going to make a flying machine, which I'm going to put somewheres and dock, and I'll tear down and put back together. It's just a simple one, uh, and we'll just have it so that I can fly a uh, thing. I might run an airport service that will transport you, I don't know, across the world decently fast. I might make it multiple seating so that multiple people can sit in it along with the pilot, which would be me, and maybe someone outside trained to use it, so on and so forth. But other than that, guys, I'm going to cut, and then we're going to go and go see if we can find a swamp. See you back in a second, guys. Alrighty, guys, I am back. What's up? So, yeah, guys, it's dark, so I'm going to go sleep. Um... So, yeah, guys, uh, I have an idea of where to look now, uh, as of where the, uh, where a swamp is. So, we need to go in, so we need to go forward and in this direction. So, we need to go northeast. If we head northeast, we should run into a swamp. Um... Although I should probably get more food before we head that direction. I need to like, keep a diamond axe for the animals. Because mosh pits, you can't swing with a sword because you'll damage all of them. Alright, let's get some food. So we're going to need some bread. Freedom. Uh, we got some, actually, we've got some stuff right here we can cook. Wow, and they're like perfect numbers too. Oh my gosh, I'm not sure those numbers could have been any perfect, so... Now those will cook. Um, so yeah, if we head northeast, which is that direction, we should be good. And we may or may not see Temp uh, and have him in this episode as well here soon. Maybe. But anyways, guys, so I'll be back in just a bit uh, once this food is cooked. And then we'll start exploring. So we, Alright, guys, we are back. And it is time to go head out and head to the northeast and go see if we can't find ourselves a swamp. It's 
not too far from here, so it shouldn't be too hard to find. Uh, hopefully my armor will hold up. Uh, I don't know. How much getting sketchy, but let's just hope it holds up. Anyway, so it's going to be a decently long walk, but, you know, get to check out the scenery while we walk. We got ourselves some steak. Sad to take a picture of that real quick. here. Looks like we're getting pretty darn close. Got some planes here. Yeah, we're getting really close. I'm kind of surprised we haven't seen it yet. Just increase the x value as much as I can here because the x value needs to be in the thousands. <laughs> oh, there's the extreme hills. The swamp's right over this hill. I can, I can almost promise you that. Is that it? It is not. Well, I think we still have about 200 blocks of walking to go before we run into it. Still, I would have figured we would have been able to see it at least. So much birch for us, man. Oh, there it is. You can see it right there. There it is. The swamp biome. So now that we are here, let's set up. So I've got to stay here till a full moon so I can get some slime. So let's chop down a couple of oak trees. We're going to get some stuff. I'm going to set up, it'll get a little shelter going, and then we'll be right back, guys. Alrighty, guys, it is daytime now. Um, it wasn't a full moon last night, so I got to wait. But I figured I'd take this opportunity and get these vines uh, and I also wanted to shear some sheep so I could make a bed but I figured I wouldn't get this opportunity again so, well, uh, not for a decent amount of time so I'm gonna shear these vines I just realized that I didn't need to do that I can shear from the bottom up um, I want to grab a couple of these vines for decoration and I guess I can grab a couple of leaves even though I can get those anywhere. I'll use these for decoration uh, along my housing. Oh no! Didn't mean to do that. That's probably good for now. Let's go see if we can't find any sheep around here that we can shear for uh, for some wool so that we can do all of that good stuff. All I need to do is make a bed so that when I'm out here I can uh, go 
go back. So let's get some pigs out here, which is good. We can have some pork. We have a slime. I never saw him. But it wasn't a full moon last night. How did you get out? Oh, I just froze there for a second. All right, let's beat you guys with fists because there's no sense in wasting your ability on my sword. Oh, you don't die. I have to, I have to charge up a full hit with my fist. Nice. Oh, uh, I always I always thought they only spawned on full moons, but I guess they have an occasional chance to spawn without full moons. poking around then to make sure that there aren't any more. The swamp's fairly large and this is probably going to be the area I check for slimes uh, when that full moon hits. And I am hyped guys, I am hyped because we've got our first slime, we haven't been out here that long and we have 13 slime balls. I'm pretty hyped. I've got a small house uh, set up over there, you guys saw me sitting in it. I built a small little hut. Uh, I want to make it s like at least like not completely. I don't. I didn't want to make a dirt hut. How's that? So I made a little oak wood hut. I had a little bit of iron to make some shears. A few other things. I do not see any sheep. It's bugging me. I'm probably gonna put a pointy little roof on it. And it's probably gonna be it. Gonna use dirt scaffolding. All right, cool. Let's use the rest for I have for stairs. We'll make some stairs. We'll wrap around it once, and then that's all I want to do. All right, let's get our stairs here. Eat our steak, and all we gotta do is wrap around the house once. But I think I'm gonna need more than twelve stairs. I'm getting more than the upstairs, so let's go get this tree right here that I planted and it grew up. Alright, cool. And that should make me enough stairs to finish off the roof. So, that's all I really want to do. I want to make a little small hut out here. I'm probably going to put a sign uh, saying that this is my hut that I used so that people know who built it. That's not just a stray hut sitting out here in the middle of nowhere. get them saplings. I definitely want to bring some oak saplings back because it's very sparse oak trees in the savannah we live in. So, probably have an oak farm. I'm probably going to have a bunch of woods. I'm going to have a wood shop again like I did a couple seasons ago and I'm going to see how that turns out. I'm trying to keep all the lighting inside the building as well so that I get mob spawns outside. So, let's throw all of our stuff away and then we're going to go uh, probably going to uh, explore a little bit around, see if we can go find some sheep, which means I want to bring my shears. Go see if we can't find any sheep in the birch forest. Uh, let's see, where are we headed right now? We're headed north, so if I head south, I'll run back into this place. I'm going to try and go as straight north as possible to where I'll still hit the swamp, which means I do have some fluctuation from back and forth. Okay. I definitely want to get Forge for 1.10, and I want to get a minimap mod and a damage indicators mod for 1.10. Um, so I can set waypoints just because I like having the freedom of doing that. Forge 1.10 is out, I do believe, so that's not. So that shouldn't be too hard as there probably are damage indicators mod and uh, minimap mod. The minimap mod is really what I'm worried about. Uh, for uh, 1.10. I do see some sheep over there, I think. Or is that just a birch tree? Uh, it's just a birch tree. 
Oh, there's some sheep over there. Look at that. I do have Optifine installed at the moment. Oh, a little bit of a stutter there. Yeah, for some reason, my, uh... My CPU's been stuttering. I may need to turn down, uh... The, uh, bitrate. Cool. Ooh, and some cows over here, too. Oh, hype. I need, I need, I need, I need you guys. Thank you. Perfect. Even got a perfect amount of that. So now let's head south. Let's do this. Yep, and this general direction should, with the, I need to tip this way a little bit. Um. So heading this general direction should bring me back to my place. Well, I've got quite a bit of wool now, though, so that's useful. I'm going to use one piece of wool just so I can get up here. There's the swamp, and where is my hut? way a tad. The swamp is not very large actually, it's fairly small. Um, so if I did lose my hut, it wouldn't be too hard to find it. I just pillared up, I could probably see the entire swamp. It's a very, very small swamp. But then again, I don't really need it too big, I just need it large enough. Yep, there it is. I just need it large enough so that it'll spawn slimes and that. And that, and big enough so that we can, uh, yeah, uh, and get a, no, 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 it's, it's just for slimes. There's really nothing else I need this for. Um, actually, oh yeah, oak wood, kind of. I mean, there's a couple forests around, but I don't want to chop them down near spawn. I'd rather chop down random oak trees out in the wilderness than so close to spawn. Especially because they're not very plentiful at spawn. You know, guys, I may have went a little overkill with the whole humble abode out here. I've had a lot of free time, uh, waiting for night, and you know, temp joined in, um, but uh, yeah, I've had a lot of free time on my hands. So, this has been my life. I'm building a little garage add-on to my base. I know I'm getting more wood than this, but... So I am waiting for a full moon to continue working, well, to, to, so I can continue getting more slime. Uh, haven't hasn't even become night yet. I've just been working on my house, waiting for it to for night to roll around. Um, nothing really. Nothing much has really happened. Except for me building this addition into the house. This needs torches, so let me go grab some torches out of here. So we've got my garage here. Actually, I don't have a door out to the back yet, so you know what? I'm gonna put this door, but not in the middle. No, no, no. It's gonna be off to the side of it. It's gonna be like right here. This is gonna be the back door. And the garage, and the garage is gonna be closed. So I'm gonna make slabs, and this is how I'm gonna close it. 
just like that. And then I'm going to take some trapdoors. Oh, shoot, I'm out of wood. I didn't mean to do that. Oh, wait, no, no I'm not. I think eight's probably good. I'm gonna take some trapdoors. Oops. Didn't mean to put you there. Ah, uh, two extras. I mean, one too many. That is fine. We're gonna put those right there. And that will cover that. Now I'm wondering how I can make an area where I can walk through through here. I mean, as you can see, can't exactly walk through this. I mean, it might, it might look visually pleasing from the outside, but you can't exactly walk through that. Irritating. Um, get back here. So, all right, let's find where the moon is. Yeah, so it's actually slimming. Let's step to the side here without falling down a hole. Yeah, so we're gonna have to go through an entire set of moon cycles. That's gonna suck. I put a slash point. Maybe we cannot sleep. Well, you know what? On the rare chance that a slime does spawn out here, we're gonna go take a quick peek around the swamp at night and go see if any slimes spawn in. Witch, a spider with speed on him, it looks like. Uh, we got a witch right up there. Um, creeper down there. Hey, buddy. Hey. Why are you running? That was bad. All right, here comes. I'm gonna go for the witch first. All right, witch is dead. Now we got a spider to deal with the speed. Cool. All right, let's keep looking. Got an entire dissolved tree over here. Lots of saplings. Uh, wow. Um, there is nothing. It is very empty. A couple more spiders. Uh, how many spiders are there? Oh my god. My internet's fluctuating all over the place for some reason. Gonna have to look into that. Tree core? Nope. <laughs> Just completely blew that. Not sure I could have blew that, blown that any harder. Oh, that's gonna bite me. That statement right there is gonna bite me. I just know it. I 
I just know it. Anyways, uh, nope. Let's eat. There seems to be no slime out here. Yeah, we might want to look into a slime chunk. We'll hollow it out, make a slime farm. Uh, we might want to look into that because this is taking forever. Uh, maybe we can try and find a slime chunk somewhere. Ah, freaking zombies are teleporting. Yo, I hit you like three times, bro. Um, yeah. But yeah, guys, uh, I think I'm gonna end it here. I hope you enjoyed. Uh, I'm gonna get some. I'm gonna get some slime. And then in the next episode, we will start on our business. Hang on. Mmm, get shrieked, kid. Alright, cool. So, next episode, we will start on getting some things. But other <laughs> some things. The next episode, we'll, we'll start on... Uh, making the business we'll finish the sky we'll finish the tower so that we can hit up the skyline uh and start the next tower and next episode uh i should be jumping in me and ug will be hopefully building a tower on the mountains over there which you saw earlier and then actually did you you know i don't know um i've made so many recordings now i can't even remember but uh yeah guys um hope you enjoyed and i'll see you guys in the next one Peace, guys.